Just one more clarification on, on Secretary Austin. So when Jake Sullivan was informed on Thursday, who informed him? It was Jake Sullivan and the chief of staff informed the president. Are you asking who I'm informed? Asking who from the Pentagon told Jake Sullivan? Oh, I I don't have that. I don't have the timeline or the or the name of the of the individuals that may have informed Jake Sullivan. What I can tell you is Jake Sullivan was informed by the Pentagon last Thursday, and from there uh, they were able to inform the president. Uh, uh, they, meaning the chief of staff and the national security advisor, informed the president. I don't have the who who actually told the national security advisor. And did whoever at the Pentagon informed Jake Sullivan tell him at that time that they regretted the delay or give any explanation for the delay? I, I, I get the question. I just don't have specifics on what was actually communicated in that conversation. What I can tell you is that's when uh, National Security Advisor Jake Sullivan uh, was uh, certainly um, um, informed uh, about Secretary Austin's uh, uh, hospitalization, uh, but I just don't have anything further on specifics of that uh, conversation. I can also share with you, as we've had many times, is that the President was informed thereafter. Has Secretary Austin apologized to the president? I don't have any specifics into their conversation. Well, I can, as you know, as we've let all of you know, that they had a conversation on Saturday, the president and the secretary. Uh, I just don't have any details into what was discussed specifically. The president, as I said moments ago at the top of this briefing, the president obviously wishes uh, the secretary uh, well and hopes he has a speedy recovery and wants to see him back, obviously, back at the Pentagon. Right.